this particular storm we thought uh, really coming in the information that we had was it was just a squall line with with uh, wind and maybe a little hail and some rain uh, as we watched it develop about the time the prom was over we continued to watch it and we were head parents there cleaning up and uh, realized that there was a tornado on the ground and we took shelter in the gymnasium and uh, of course everybody there was safe uh, just so have my da daughter was here from high school or from college excuse me and uh, she had taken shelter in the safe room of our house my neighbor over here came over and got her out he called me and said where is your daughter i said we've got her on the phone she's in the safe room he says i'm gonna go get her your house is gone it makes, makes you weak in the knees, and you just don't know how to react to that. And so we loaded up and we got here as fast as we could. We had to park at the end of the street, obviously, and walk in and uh, just, you know, just gut-wrenching. We thought it was over because we've been listening to the radio all night. And um, so I was just like, all right, well, apparently nothing's going on, so I'm just going to go to sleep because i got a really day tomorrow. So I lay down, and I hear this really loud sound like a train. And my wife comes running out of the bedroom, and I, was like, and I told her, I was like, that is the loudest train I've ever heard. And she's like, that's a tornado. And I looked out the window, and I saw the transformer right, right down there, right in the middle of where them big piles are. I saw it spark, and I was like, oh my god, we have to go. And then uh, we, we basically we went to the shelter, and then after after everything cleared up, I mean, we could uh, we were looking at the sky and everything. It was pitch black up here towards uh, towards Kansas. Um, and then uh, over here, the big uh, the big oil refinery, you could yep. see the, the, the fire was lighting up the sky, and then it got real, real dim, so we thought another one was coming in. And then we got the all clear later on when the officers started coming in. We started hearing about people trapped in the houses. 